Hi, I'm Amelia Seja and I'm thrilled to share with you the history of the bell that has been incorporated into our label. Pedro, my husband and founder, one of the founders of Seja Vineyards, suggested that we needed to pay homage to how wine was introduced to California via the missions. And uh, we decided that we would adopt a bell. Which bell? Well, he drew it and a wonderful graphic designer in Santa Lina uh, designed about 10 different bells. And we uh, love this one. And um, Judy Undercuffler, the, the, our label designer, incorporated it into our label. And it's quite meaningful. So um, I contacted South Bay Bronze. This is seven years ago. And I made a phone call and uh, Gil Hernandez answered the phone. His parents are also Mexican. So it immediately um, brought us you know, close and he's a very dear friend. So South Bay Bronze was founded in 1846 during the gold rush. It's one of the longest uh, foundries in operation in California. Uh, he purchased it in 1983 and moved it from San Francisco to San Jose. This bell is beautiful. It's one of a kind and it would have cost us a fortune. However, he used um, a very ancient methods of first uh, doing a model, a wooden model, and then casting numerous bells. So that now Seja Vineyards owns four bells. But this is the very, very first one, and he called this the Chardonnay bell, and it's the one that is not missing any of the little details that some of the other ones are. So I hope you come and visit us so you can see and touch these beautiful bells and uh, thank you for tuning in until next time